I eat a lot of meat. Chicken, beef, turkey, bacon, sausages, all of it. And there's many reasons why. Firstly, meat is absolutely packed full of protein. Secondly, it tastes amazing. And thirdly, a massive reason. Growing up watching the TV, adverts would always tell me meat is what I need to grow and that I should eat a lot of it. In addition, even my schools were saying meat is needed for a balanced diet. But how true is all of this? Is meat the king of all foods? Well, there's a group of individuals who really don't think so. Consider veganism. 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 Is veganism the way to go? Recently, veganism has taken the world by storm. There's a huge amount of evidence that if people were to adopt a plant-based diet, then all of this chronic disease would disappear. So much research, studies, even documentaries have been done supposedly proving why being vegan is healthier. Okay, but that doesn't take away from the fact that vegan food, it tastes like sh Right? Well, wrong. Apparently, anyway. Introducing McDonald's first ever vegan burger, designed to exactly replicate the taste, texture, and look of their normal meat burgers. And so far, the reviews of them have been insane. No. Huh? No. Oh, my mama, McDonald's, if by chance you decide to release the McPlant nationwide, that McPlant is gonna sell. If you want my opinion, I do not believe the technology has gone that far to where a company can exactly replicate a meat burger into a vegan one. I, I don't think it's possible. There was only one way to find out. Can I order? Hi, can I get the new McPlant, please? Thank you, cheers. We have the new McPlant and the quarter pounder with cheese. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. These two burgers are identical, apart from the fact that one's vegan and one's not. I'm gonna go out the car. How my housemate is then gonna take the burgers out of the packaging so I can't tell which is which, and he's gonna give me them one by one. First burger I'm gonna give him is gonna be the meat burger, and the second burger is gonna be the vegan burger. My job is to try and guess which is the vegan one and which is the meat one. Oh, just a quick PSA. I've never had a McDonald's quarter pounder in my life, so both these burgers are fresh to me. <laughs> I have two burgers for you. I'm so excited for this. All right, burger one. Okay, I need to know. That's really good, like really, really good. Initial impression, I think that that's the meat, but my mind could change. It's the second burger. Oh, it's it. Really? I can't tell. Really? I can't tell. Can I try the other one? Yeah. I genuinely could not tell the difference. I am clueless on which is which at the moment. That is mental. They both taste the same. If I had to guess, yeah. number one is the meat and number two is vegan. You are correct. I'm right. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, that is, bro, that was a, that was a pretty much 50-50 guess. The result shocked me. The burgers tasted almost identical. But is the vegan burger healthier? The quarter pounder versus the McPlant. Okay, so first, calories. The quarter pounder has 518, whereas the McPlant has only 429, so nearly 100 less. Next, the evil saturated fat. The quarter pounder has a large 13 grams in, whereas the McPlant only has 6.6 .6 grams. And finally, we're gonna look at the protein. This is the one and only downside I can see of the McPlant. The quarter pounder contains a solid 31 grams, whereas the McPlant only 19. But if I had to crown one for being healthier, I'd say the McPlant wins. But I need to get more opinions on this. So I went out into the streets of Nottingham to see if the public could taste the difference between the Quarter Pounder and the McPlant. I put the burgers into identical cases so the public don't know the burger they're eating. Let's see if they can work out which is which. Burger number one. Burger number one. Do you want to take a fat bite of this? Okay, so the first burger I gave to everyone was the vegan one. I would say that's meat. You think that's meat? Okay. It tastes like meat, so I'm gonna say just meat. Yeah. It just tastes like regular McDonald's burger. Right, first opinion, what do you think that is? Mm, I think that's meat. Okay. I don't think that's meat. You think that's vegan? I think that might be vegan. Okay, so we've got two different answers. I don't know. Oh? <laughs> Initial impressions, do you think this is the meat or the vegan? Nothing vegan. Same vegan. That's vegan. You think that's the vegan one? I don't know. I'll start off with plant one. Okay, so the results after tasting the first burger. Four out of 15 thought it was meat. Six out of 15 thought it was vegan. And five were unsure. Next, I gave everyone the meat burger. Yeah, I kind of want to change my answer now. You think that's the meat now? <laughs> it feels much drier, so I think that's the um, the regular one. Yeah, that's definitely a meat one. No, that's the beef one. Both meat. 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 Are you 100% sure with your answers? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think that's, that's the, the meat. Burger. Burger. That's the burger. That's definitely the, the meat. burger. Yeah. yeah, this is definitely the meat. After tasting the meat burger, a lot of opinions changed. Most of the contestants could tell that this was the beef. However, 11 out of 15 said they preferred the taste of the vegan one. Yeah. Which one did you prefer the taste of? The, the vegan one. I, I preferred yeah, the vegan one. The vegan one. That tastes better. Oh, you think the vegan one tastes better? 
Yeah. I was going to go vegan, I could cope with that. So, has this whole experiment convinced me to go vegan? No. Realistically, it hasn't. Personally, I just don't think there's enough good vegan food out there. The McPlant is an exception, it's amazing, but the key word being an exception. However, I feel like if you ask me in about 10 years time, there will be an insane amount of vegan options which taste exactly like regular meat. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, boys.